everyone, this is Cory from At Cory's Reborns, and today I'm going to do a what's in my diaper bag. So, let's just go ahead and get started. A little backstory behind this diaper bag. My mom actually bought this for me as a Christmas present a year ago, and um, she didn't know I was collecting. I didn't even know I was going to be collecting, and it actually ended up being a diaper bag. She just thought it was a really big bag. So I think that's pretty neat and um, my husband actually found me the matching changing station changing pad thing um, at Burlington for a discounted price which was really really cool. So anyways, let me just go ahead and get started letting you know what's in here. And the changing pad does fit in here with it closed. So. Really quickly, I'm just going to let you know, the inside, let's fold this out, the inside, I love this bag, is this really pretty print. It's different from the outside. I think it looks really cute. So, um, in here we have this dinosaur bag, which holds the pajamas, hats, some extra socks I think and some swaddling blankets and it does match with the baby crib bedding and I got it with it so then I have some diapers here size 2 and size newborn with the belly button cutouts because you never know who I'm taking I got this little lovey for baby Robin and these this lovey is actually Nala's special lovey she really loves this lovey little cow and if you press him right here he starts mooing I think it's really cute and this little green frog is really soft and he's hypoallergenic so any of the babies can use him we also have in here a lint roller because I like to lint roll the baby's clothes before they put it on and in this little tube right here I keep the pacifiers Nala actually does not like a pacifier um, which is nice but I keep baby Robins in here I don't know if I showed you I have the detangling spray and a brush I got three bottles so I have an Avent bottle a newbie bottle which I love these newbies bottles and a tiny little bottle for Robin I also have some baby oil in here and some aloe vera just in case one of the babies gets a sunburn which I doubt will happen but you can never be too careful. I also have some headache medicine for myself just in case they're screaming all day long. <laughs> Which hopefully they don't start screaming because I don't have to send them back where they came from. <laughs> and, okay. Sorry. And in this bag, I've got some outfits for Robin because right now the diaper bag is ready for me to take Robin out because he's the one I'm going to be taking out today. And I've got this little sleeper that he came with. It has the hand mittens. And it's useful just in case. And I also got this two piece um, sleeper set. Which I guess he could use as an outfit also for the day. So this is like a little gray snap shirt. I got some extra socks and three little hats. I got uh, one that matches with that sleeper set and I'm casting a shadow. It's horrible. I got the gray one for his other sleeper and I got this little green hat to keep the sun out of his eyes just in case. And then I got this little Burt's Bees blanket. And I have this little swaddle blanket and that's what's in there I'm probably shaking the camera and I'm really sorry
And so that's it for that. what's in the bag here. This is going to be a pretty quick video. But um, in the changing pad, so I'm going to try to move this out of the way here. The changing pad opens up and rolls out like so. And I have a little powder here and some desitin just in case one of the babies gets a diaper rash. Another pair of extra socks, some little pants, a white onesie, and a pair of hand mittens. Just a quick change, um, just in case I'm in, uh, I'm changing the babies and they, I leave my, um, diaper bag, you know, at the dinner table or something like that and I just bring this. It's not such a hassle to have a baby in such a big bag all the time. And then I have all the diapers in here. I got a little snuggler, an honest diaper, a little, I don't even know, I think this is a Pampers, and these silly little ducky ones, and I love this changing pad because, you know, you could put it on top of those changing stations and your baby's not laying directly on it, and the diapers act as like a little, like they hold up the baby's head, so I think that's cool. Obviously you have to have a diaper ready, taken out of there, put the baby down, but I love it. I love this changing pad. Anywho. So yeah, that's what is in my diaper bag for the babies. And on the outside pockets, I usually keep the my wallet or, you know, some snacks for Nala. But other than that, um, that's what's in there. And thank you for watching. If you like this video let me know and let me know what other kinds of videos you want to see from me because uh, I'm kind of running out of ideas <laughs> but um, maybe I'll go ahead and show you Nala because today she's really loving her vegetables and you'll see what I mean about that in a moment look at her with her little vegetable friends that's Carl carrot and this is Bert broccoli and she's wearing her little vegetable romper. Can you say hi, honey? And her little vegetable socks. And I thought she looked super cute. Super, super cute. So, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Hope you like this video. And we'll see you next time. Bye bye.